All right. Supposing. Okay, here's multiple choice. Let's think of three answers. Three answers. Okay, if we run out of coffee pods, do we, A, jump up and down and scream and say, Oh, my God, I got no coffee pods. Now what do we do? Or do we, B, get in our car and drive to the store and buy another box of coffee pods? Or, or C, do we call 911? Coffee, Hannah. Yep, I am. <laughs> Bless you, Obed. Oh, Poor Obed's been so sick. Garbage. Same place it always is, Hannah. Speaking of all my storms. Ha! Yes. Speaking of all my storms. <laughs> Hannah. Yes. You have merch. Oh my storms. I like your coffee cup. Thank you. Oh my storms. <laughs> How cool is that? Very cool. Yes. Yeah. Does it make you feel special or I don't know. Does, <laughs> how does it make you feel uh, to have merch? Ecstatic. Ecstatic. <laughs> it is kind of funny, isn't it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> the cups are kind of cool, though. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. Except I don't want it to come off in the wash. In the no, wash. it won't. It's on there pretty good. It it is oh. like a it's like a baked on Ooh. sticker of sorts. Woo. But it's you know it's decent. It's oh. it's just cute. It's just a cute mug. Thanks. Yeah. I just wish they were brailled. <laughs> you wish the cups were brailled? Yeah. Oh, that would be a whole new level, wouldn't it? Yeah. All right. <laughs> and I got my other, this is my favorite saying. In my world, everything sounds so happy. It's what Hannah had said at the end of the video in the SBSK Day in the Life that uh, Chris came and did on our family. And I just thought that was such a profound and sweet thing that Hannah just kind of came up with out of the blue. And and when I heard it, when the video um, was posted, it just really choked me up a little bit. It just really did come out of nowhere. So that's my favorite one right there. Let me see Hannah's name on there. Cool. Uh, so... We, so, so we're kind of running out of coffee pots, and it'll be a big emergency if we run out mid, midway. Why do you think it would be such an emergency? Because, well, we just cannot be without coffee pods. Well, that's true. We cannot be without coffee pods. But why do you think that we're going to run out so soon. Um, what makes you think that? Because I'm estimating that in the drawer that there are kind of like three or four left. Well, maybe you overestimated your underestimation and maybe there are more coffee pods in the drawer than you think there are. Yeah, because this morning I I went into the drawer mm -hmm. and then, and then I've, and then it felt like 13 of them only. Well, it is running low. But for example, how many coffee pods will you be drinking tomorrow? Probably just two. Just two. So how many do you think Mama Bear is going to drink? Uh, two? Well, probably more than that, if the truth be known. <laughs> so how many do you think Papa Bear is going to drink? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> If you feel anxious about the coffee pods in the drawer, one thing you could do is you could take your two pods and set them aside so that you can be assured 
that no one else will get into your coffee pots. Yeah, I just sometimes don't... mom does that when the drawer runs low. Yeah, but I, I just don't have a wanna... stash. Yeah, I just don't want to uh, leave them out loose. Well, you can hide them in another drawer if you'd like, if you're that anxious about it. Oh. But Hannah, how far away from our house is the grocery store? Uh, kind of like next door neighbors? Yeah, kind of really close, right? Yeah. So supposing we ran out completely, as if not even running low, but completely running out. Supposing we run completely out mid-morning, on Saturday. Uh. Then what do we do? Panic and freak out. <sighs> Hannah. How about if I, <laughs> I can't even stand this, you're kind of funny, but how about, how about if I do this multiple choice? Okay, I'm gonna give you. <laughs> real guys this is real like we're not even we're not even kidding about this all right hannah <laughs> oh my god you're a piece of work you know that <laughs> all right supposing okay here's multiple choice let's think of three answers three answers okay if we run out of coffee pods do we a jump up and down and scream and say oh my god or do we B get in our car and drive to the store and buy another box of coffee pods or, two. or C do we call 911 <laughs> oh do you see how ridiculous this is now what would your answer be Hannah are you going to give me a Hannah answer? Or are you going to give me a real answer? Well, we might as well just go in the corner. <laughs> 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 Do you see how ridiculous you are sometimes? Like you guys, I'm not kidding you even a little bit. She has been she has been anxious about these coffee pots since the day we opened this newest box. She's like she's like worried that we're, you you shouldn't be as worried. Are you worried? Why are you worried? Do you think your mother's going to turn into a monster if we don't have them? Well, or is it for your own coffee pod necessities? Uh, it's both. <laughs> Do you see how silly that is? Well, you might as well like jump in the car and then might as well because it'll only take ten minutes and to then go start do it. chanting. Well, you could chant if you want. But <laughs> do you, so. Let me ask. I mean, I mean, do you think that we should call nine one one if we run out of coffee pods? No, but we should probably Why not, sound Hannah? an alarm. Why not, Hannah? Because what do you know anything about calling nine one one in times of non emergencies, <laughs> Hannah? No, we might go to jail. Uh, jail. Has that ever happened to you before? Uh, uh, probably. You want to tell us about it? So, so I was, so I, I had, I didn't know what 911 was for. So I, I, I experimented and, um. True and story, I, by the way. And then I said, and then they said, this is 911. How may I help you? And then I was like, oops, wrong number. <laughs> and then what happened? Then dad. And then, and then the 911 department called dad and or one of you mm -hmm. on this house phone and then I was scared because they know all about the residents here don't they uh, yeah yeah and so then what and then someone or dad took me to the police station and they interrogated me they did indeed oh man oh yeah oh man <sighs> were you a little nervous there Hannah uh, yeah, I was, like, shaking in my booties. Because, did you think you were going to go to jail that day? Yeah, I thought I was. Huh. And then, and then, apparently I'm still here. Apparently you are. 
Hannah, calling 911 in some in an emergency that you deem to be an emergency that is not life threatening is not you don't call 911. I know that. Now, if your mother's passed out on the floor not breathing due to the fact that there weren't any coffee pots. <laughs> And that's a different story. <laughs> and we're joking about this, but this is a serious issue, isn't it? Uh, pretty much. So we need to kind of keep things in check. Yeah. Right? Uh-huh. And in perspective. Yeah. Right? Uh-huh. Okay. Is anybody here going to die without a coffee pod? Uh, I might go crazy. I didn't say go crazy. I said, is anyone going to die without a coffee pod? No. Probably not. Therefore, it's not an emergency. Uh, so, uh, so in my mind, um, if we ran out of coffee pots, I, um, instead of freaking out, I might, I might start, uh, setting an alarm, setting an alarm off, like a chanting alarm. <laughs> well, it would be better to set off a chanting alarm <laughs> Yeah. You, my dear, As a reason, uh, are a piece of work. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs>